As a retired clergywoman and educator, Mary Louise Stanley Weinkoff celebrates her career, which spanned multiple decades. She is well versed in the Lutheran faith, and she has devoted a significant amount of time and effort to spreading the teachings of that faith through her services as a pastor. Dr. Weinkoff began her career with the foundation of a strong education. She earned a Bachelor of Arts in English from Wisconsin State University in 1961, as well as a Master of Arts and Ph.D., both in English, from the University of Tennessee. With these degrees under her belt, she felt empowered to make her mark as an assistant professor of English at Adrian College. In only three years, Dr. Weinkoff had progressed to a full professorship with Dakota Wesleyan University, and she even became the head of the English department. To this day, Dr. Weinkoff cites her proudest accomplishment to be her transition from student to professor to minister. Following her work as an educator, Dr. Weinkoff went on to pursue a Master of Divinity through the Lutheran School of Theology in 1993. She has passionately practiced her faith as a pastor from 2006 until 2013. She spent this time preaching at Calvary Evangelical Lutheran Church and Siloa Lutheran Church. She has also served as a trustee of the Educational Foundation from 1986 until 1990 and a member of the Board of Directors for the Ontonagon County Habitat for Humanity from 1995 until 1997. When asked about the figures that she considers to be role models, Dr. Weinkoff named Dietrich Bonhoeffer, who was a German Lutheran pastor. Bonhoeffer's bravery in voicing his opposition to the Nazi regime was punished by imprisonment in and ultimately execution at a concentration camp. Dr. Weinkoff also named as an inspiration Paul Manns, who was a celebrated American composer and who was twice named one of the ten most influential Lutherans. Dr. Weinkoff is proud to leave her legacy to her two children, Stephen and Zanti, as well as her six grandchildren. It is her hope that they may look back on her accomplishments and hope to surpass them.